I shouldn't be much longer. Have they found you somewhere? No, they've just gone off to talk to someone. What have they been doing all this time? Just asking all these questions. What sort of questions? I don't know. The way she was going on, it was like it was all my fault. Like I wasn't fit to be a mother or something. Well, she actually said that? Well, she didn't have to. It was obvious what she was thinking. Poor cat, can't cope. Look at her. Shouldn't be allowed, someone like that, looking after little kids. Someone should do it for her. I just slept rough the first couple of nights. What do you mean, where? Wherever I could. Third or fourth night, I managed to get into this boarded up building. And that was good? Or better than... Better than some places. But you meet people in the same situation. They look out for you and you look out for them. Because you need to or... or because it's dangerous? What do you want me to say? That it's fine, just like a holiday? It isn't. But most people do come back. I did. Most. Some don't. I'll come see you tomorrow. Oh, uh, I've written it down somewhere. I'll text you, okay? Morgan had a little accident. All the excitement, probably. I'll change it for you, all right? Thanks. I'm really sorry, Bianca. It's all right. All worked out all right in the end. Where is everyone? Oh, Janine went off on one. Now Pat and Peggy are upstairs crying on each other's shoulders. Melinda's gone home because she's in a strop with me. And as I've turned round, you've gone away well as well. You know, I wasn't going to get everyone to raise their glasses. You know, last toast and all that, but... It's not much of a farewell, is it? Me with a pint of lager in my hand. <laughs> 